Do you think that them. technology, though, will be then moved into regular vehicles? And be yeah, so there's Mirai. Right. So, so Toyota has the Mirai, Hyundai has the Nexo, Honda has a Clarity, and they're all three a hydrogen. hydrogen fuel cells. Oh, okay. So it's already. Yeah. Is that y'all's technology they're using, or are they using this hydrogen? Technology? No, they, they've, they've, already they've, they've already got it. They've yeah, already so got hydrogen. It. Oh, okay. Um, so it'll be used in passenger vehicles, but you know, for our company, there's a lot of opportunity in addition to that in heavy transportation. So, for example, trucks. boats, trucks. Well, yeah. There, yeah. There's, boats? Well, yeah, there's so. We you want the hydrogen in boats. You get a, you well, know, shipping containers. You get containers. a lot of range. <laughs> shipping, oh, well. You get a lot of range. <laughs> uh, you know, if you, want, if you want more range, just get another fuel tank. You can extend it as long as you want, as much as you want. Uh, it does really well in hot and cold, so you don't have to be concerned about that. Uh, if you compare it to battery, the Ford Lightning loses half of its towing capacity when you're towing a heavy trailer. Yeah. You don't have that issue with fuel cell. So there's yeah. a lot of good so uh, still, benefits. You still have all that power. Yeah. You still got all that power. So it could actually be in pickup trucks that we're driving right now. Yep. So Shell's got their station. Says, we're, we're, we're terrible people for driving. <laughs> well, Shell, Shell's got their station, and so this is going to help with the rollout of the infrastructure. But if you were to put one of these at a, at a return to base fueling model for a type of vehicle that comes home every night, like buses or dump trucks or garbage trucks then you don't have to build quite as much infrastructure at the start yeah because they don't have to all go refuel at a gas station they yeah. just all come home at night and you can refill a tank in three to five minutes so you don't have to charge it yeah for the same duration. what's a tank of hydrogen cost right now most hydrogen is made from natural gas and the price has gone up so currently a kilogram of hydrogen, which is roughly equivalent to a gallon of gas, is $17. But it was substantially lower a few months ago. Well, let's say last year before the Ukraine invasion pushed up natural gas prices. But industry do have uh, we do have some components that are that are NASA technology. So I can't remember all of them. It's several, yeah. but what, uh, what, what, you know? I, of course, I know that that costs. I don't know how much bill that would. But, uh, but uh, you got three of them. What, what do you think they will be in the price range? One point like two. Vince? One point, one point two. two million. Yeah. Oh, that's not too much compared to spaghetti. Let's see. Sure Divided by thirty-six months, add a little interest. <laughs> 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 no problem, 50 grand a month. Yeah. Would that cover it? Would that cover 50 grand a month? Yeah. Yeah, my, then we'll, I cover we could, it. Almost, yeah. 50 grand Depends a month. Depends on the rates. Yeah, the rates. Oh, well, yeah, that's that so. too. <laughs> well, they'll, they'll, they'll figure it out. They'll Google it and be like, oh. It. He might not watch it, so it's a little bad. Unless he watches the video, it's a little bad. Yeah. It's probably not on our YouTube. <laughs> that is just like Oh, that is awesome. Oh, perfect. But yeah, he was in LA. Uh, two weeks ago, and he saw a picture. He was like, I wonder if that's the same one that was at the Peterson yeah, Museum. Yeah, it is, yeah. We have two. That's one. This is yeah. it. Yeah.